Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. I am here today to share with you week four of the Two C's collab. Um, so the theme for this upcoming week, which starts tomorrow, is Tetris week. We all have it, those shapes that are a pain to store, whether it's a muffin or a shell or a tart, some things are just not stackable. Melt anything from your stash that is hard to store because of the shape. So these are things that I pulled that fit that criteria. Um, so the week starts tomorrow on March 20th and it goes March 20th to March 26th. And then tomorrow being the first day of spring, it says pick a scent that meets the weekly prompt that celebrates this day. So for tomorrow, I pulled from Vintage Road Candles. This is called Six Feet Under, and it's patchouli, dirt, antique rose, nog champa, oud wood, fallen leaves, and campfire marshmallow. Mm. And I love these types of blends. You definitely get that soil, that dirt scent. Um, a little bit of rose, but it's a nice rose. I'm not a lover of rose in scents, so it's nicely blended. The patchouli, the oud wood. Um, so I'm really looking forward to this. I, to me, when I think spring, I think all things fresh and new and growing and all of that. So I'm gonna warm this, but I'm going to combine it because I pulled tomato leaf from Sugar and Spice Gourmet Soy Candles for my Green Week, which ends today. And I just didn't get to these, so those are going back in. I have from L3 Waxy Wonders, this is Nocturne Alley in an owl. So I have that. Um, Pink Fairy from Rose Girls, Lavender Laundry, Strawberry Pound Cake, Pink Sugar, and Vanilla Ice Cream. Going to be reorganizing as we go. Um, from Ella After, excuse me, from Ella After Wax, this is Nelly Love It, and this is Blood Raspberries, Marshmallow Fireside, and Vanilla Pie Crust. So excited to warm those. And they're kind of like odd shaped. So I'm just pulling what I think. Gold Sugar Spring Breeze from L3. I've been wanting to warm this for a long time. Mm. Just perfect for spring. There's that. I have Morning Hustle from Empire Alchemy and these donuts and it's raspberry filled donuts, uh, vanilla ice cream, hot coffee, and what does that say? Hot coffee, cream, and oh, a hint of fig. I'm reading that and it's looking like it says mint of fig. And this smells absolutely delicious. This is gonna go in my warmest tomorrow morning. You get equal parts of um, a nice, strong, freshly roasted, like freshly roasted coffee beans and that mm, delicious raspberry. So very excited for that. A sample from Rose Girls, because these tend to get like lost in the shuffle of circus concession. I have bought this so many times in years past. I've honestly burnt myself out on it. It's not that I don't like it. It's just, it's not my favorite anymore. Um, it's Macintosh apples, cotton candy, cut, whoops, cotton candy frosting, caramel, and funnel cake. So we have that. I have a sample from the Bathing Garden in Victorian Midway. I have a bunt from, um, L3 and beware of the plastics. And this is sugared lavender, sugar, oh my gosh, I had too much coffee today. Sugared lavender twist and today is October 3rd. This is, this is okay to me. Um, I think I've had it before, but I'm gonna give it another, another go. 
You guys, look at that. I don't even know if it will totally. Carson, do you remember this one? This is the scent, the blend that Carson told me about. And when I went to go order, they only have the ginormous size, which I was totally fine with. I mean, I didn't have to buy this. So this is from the bathing garden. It's smoky patchouli, sandalwood, and fire smoke. And oh, I can't wait to warm this. But as you can see, it definitely takes up a lot of space. I know I can chop it all up and um, make it make more room, but I have this like laying like this in a drawer and it just takes up a lot of space. It did come a little broken. That's okay, it's wax. And I'm just going to warm it. Okay, from the pharmacist's daughter, I have Weight of My Heart, which is Fruity Pebbles, Satsuma, Strawberry, White Cake, and these little, they look like little, like Valentine's chocolate. So I want to get that warmed. Another one from the pharmacist's daughter is, what are you called? XOXO, it's floral, lime, neroli, musk, and frankincense, which I love frankincense. I love neroli. I mean, I love all of this. Lime, everything. Um, I've pulled this so many times and then I just don't, I don't know why. I just don't get to it. Tonka and Oud from L3. This is a chunk muffin from Rose Girls and it's Hello Summer. And you guys, I've had this thing chopped for so long and it's super old. And it's definitely getting on the lighter side. I think when I first bought this, it smelled too strong maybe. But shame on me because I let this really sit. I'm gonna say this is probably like, th like three years old. Fluff and Fold from L3, which is Domestic Goddess and Pink Chiffon. Another chunk muffin from Rose Girls in Tangerine Lemonade Ginger Ale. I have had so many of these, and when I tell you guys, this is so unbelievably strong. It's so strong, and you get that uh, effervescent note from the ginger ale, crazy in here. Um, you get tangerine and uh, lemonade also. This is really good. Um, I know that these ones aren't hard to store, but I have a reason for why I'm warming them. This is from Lasting Scent Candles. If you guys have not had the opportunity to buy from her, I ordered from her many years ago. She was around and her stuff was easier to get. Then she kind of closed up for a while and she's back, but she only opens every once in a while. And I want to say she has an opening coming up. Oh my gosh, sometime next week, I want to say. I'll have to go back and look. But this is Berry Panna Cotta. And I just don't like um, the way these bags close. They're not hard to store or anything like that. And I know I could put them into other bags, but it's just a push for me to go ahead and use this. So these are getting, that is getting used. It smells delicious. And another one from Lasting Scent Candles is in Toasted Embers. And it is smoky and marshmallow and just deliciousness. So that's getting added in. I have um, Dragon Alley from L3, also in a owl. I have Zombie Juice from Rainbow Melts, and it's Honey Pear Cider, and I absolutely love this. Mmm, makes my mouth water. This is a delicious, delicious scent, and it, they're, blah, they are in Ghosts, two different ones, so we're gonna warm those. I have this from The Bathing Garden in Vanilla Dumpling, and it is like a, um, caramel apple, like the stick is in there. So kind of a pain to store. I've had this before, really, really like it. Um, cinnamon Crunch from Rainbow Melts, a sample, and it's sweet cinnamon toast and crunchy sugar cookies. This is like very craft store cinnamon. 
So I will see how um, this one does. And then lastly, I have from um, Waxidents Summer Cooler in Lemonade and Cherry Slushy in uh, Dinosaur. So that's it, you guys. Those are my picks for this upcoming week. I hope you are all doing well and staying safe, and I will talk to you soon. Bye-bye.